and all the comments. How are you guys doing tonight? Good. Woo! Woo! So you guys are really excited. I got my headshots back today. So uh, looks like I'm going to be a writer. <laughs> <laughs> so my manager's like, Victoria, stick to writing. They looked at my headshot and they're like, okay, this is vomit. Like, <laughs> no, you guys, I got a role as a shadow. I'm like, okay, a shadow. Like, I work in production, so it's like, okay, we could just adjust the lighting for that, you know, instead of paying me for the shadow a few times. So, uh, you guys, my mom's Italian, and uh, my dad is Spanish, and I just found out I'm part American Indian. I was like, Dad, I think you would have told us this growing up, right? So I'm really excited about my new Indian name, Sleeps on Bar. <laughs> and I'm going to open up my new casino. You guys are all invited. Gotta go. So yeah, good times. Oh man. Um, did you guys ever date someone who went to great lengths to get you out of your clothes only because they wanted to wear them? <laughs> so this guy who tells me, he's like, I think I'm half gay. And I was like, half gay? What does that mean, you know? I was so naive. I was like, well, you know, like, I don't know, he blamed his five sisters for being half gay. And I was like, well, what, you know, I thought, well, if he's gay on top, like, that would be cool. Because, you know, he'd be, like, super ripped and, like, stylish and fun. And then I thought, well, if he's straight on the bottom, like, I can work yeah. with that, right? So, uh, but he was like, no, Victoria, I think I'm half gay. And I was like, well, what do you mean? Like, half gay on Fridays? Like, <laughs> part-time? Like, like, balls? Like, what's going on? But I should have seen the signs. You know, like, the red flags that you ignore when you're dating someone? I don't know. I always do this, you guys. So, uh, like, we would leave the bars, and he would leave with, like, all the guys' phone numbers. I was like, wow, I just thought he was being friendly. I didn't know he wanted to sleep with these friends. So, and then we'd go to a concert, and then, uh, you know, he would leave with, like, the whole band's phone number. I was like, wow, I didn't know we both wanted to sleep with the band. So, uh, and then, you know, at the end of the night, we go back to his place, and I'm thinking, okay, we should be having sex right now, right? But uh, he wanted to make cookies. So I was like, okay, that's kind of half gay, right? Baking cookies. <laughs> and so even the cookies were kind of half gay, like they were sugar cookies. And like King frosting and like sequins <laughs> and sprinkles. So uh, yeah, good times. Oh man, I, I I totally lost out. Some guy named Chuck. Yeah, they're in Lithuania, having a good time. <laughs> so you guys, I stayed too long in Europe. I was a legal alien, and uh, it's tough when you look like you can be from anywhere, but nowhere good. So. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I was doing some work in Paris, and uh, I didn't know when um, you rent an apartment in Paris, you need to find out, like, does my apartment have a toilet? It was like, literally, like, my toilet was like, you know, two towns down. <laughs> so uh, I'd have to go to the, use the bathroom there. But, uh, and also if you rent an apartment in Paris, you need to make sure, like, does my apartment have a shower? You guys, there was no shower. It was like, literally, like, a bucket with, like, a plastic curtain. I was like, oh my gosh, this is exactly why my friends in France don't shower. It's like, who has a shower in a bucket? That's why, uh, you know, the French invented perfume. It's like, we're gonna shower. I'm just gonna spray myself with perfume. Wear my French beret and my scarf. I'm good to go. Uh. So, uh, but when you go out, you know, in France, like everybody's smoking, you know, it's just, I always smell like a chimney. So my friends were like, Victoria, what did you bring back from Paris? I was like, cancer. <laughs> that way I have cancer. <laughs> so, uh, my boyfriend, he told me to be more affectionate, so uh, now I have two boyfriends. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thanks you guys, you're awesome! <laughs> Woo! <laughs>